Gray wolf, red fox. Did you ever see a photograph of a gray? Did you ever see a photograph of a gray wolf or a red fox? Don't they look a lot like dogs? Aren't they fantastic looking animals? Well, dogs, foxes, and wolves are all related. They are all members of the same family. And while gray wolves and red foxes may look alike, they are different in many ways. Looks are everything. The gray wolf is the largest member or a part of the wild dog family. An adult wolf is the size of a large dog. The red fox is smaller and weighs less. Both animals have excellent hearing. The red fox can even hear small animals digging holes underground. And just take a look at those beautiful tails. The gray wolf and red fox both have long, bushy tails. The wolf's tail can be two feet long. The fox's tail is not as long but has a bright white tip. In the winter, foxes use their thick, furry tails as protection from the cold. The gray wolf and red fox are both mammals. Foxes and, foxes and wolves also have thick fur. Their coats can be white, brown, or black. However, red foxes most often have red fur, while a gray wolf's fur is usually more gray and brown. Finding food. Gray wolves and red foxes live in many different habitats. They live in forests, deserts, woodlands, and grasslands. But as more people build roads and shopping centers, both animals have lost their homes. The red fox has adapted well or made changes to fit into its environment. Now more foxes make their homes close to towns and parks. Wolves, however, stay far away from towns and people. Foxes and wolves are not in competition for food. They have different diets. Red foxes prefer to hunt alone and eat small animals, birds, and fish. They also like to raid garbage cans and campsites for food. Wolves work together in packs or groups to hunt large animals such as moose and deer. Where do they live? United States of America. Legend. Red. Red fox only. Gray. Gray wolf only. Orange. Both. Gray wolves prefer to live and hunt in packs. Day to day. Wolves live in packs of four to seven. They do almost everything together. They hunt, travel, and choose safe places to set up dens for shelter. Foxes, on the other hand, like to live alone. They usually sleep in the open or find an empty rabbit hole to call home. Both wolves and foxes communicate by barking and growling. The gray wolf also howls to alert or warn other wolves when there is danger nearby. The red fox signals in a different way. It waves its tail in the air to caution other foxes. The gray wolf and red fox are members of the same family and have many things in common, but they really are two very different animals. The red fox hunts for food alone.